Only thing worse than a coward is a coward with power. This is just your friendly reminder that you are not blessed. You are privileged. Not hashtag blessed, hashtag privileged. Can't be one and the same. I mean, yeah, you, she's technically not wrong, which, as you all know, is the best type of not wrong. <laughs> but being not wrong does not make you correct. The deal is that blessings and privileges, I mean, they're not the same thing. They are in the same family, but they're more cousins than brother and sister. Can you dig it? Because, you know, when it comes to blessings, every, every single one, every single breath is one if that's how you decide to look at life that's the way i decide to look like like oh every time i get to i ain't on the respirator you know i ain't all fucked up and shit like okay yeah blessings and if that blessing like did and, and if you're if you consider that in and of itself a big enough blessing then literally everything's a fucking privilege <laughs> Everything is a privilege that can be taken from you in in a heartbeat, in a matter of a second. That ability to breathe clearly, that ab that ability to you know run, jump, or like or or think, you know properly. It's all privilege if you come to it from that mindset, or you know. You be more of a chick about it and just be, and just look at what others are doing and say, ugh, gross, how dare, anything like, sweet, sweetheart, 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 like, why you even give a shit about what they're doing? Your shit should be on point. But once again, fellas, we discussed this before. It's why it's called a sin stick, or, you know, at least I call it a sin stick. Let's keep going. So when you post pictures of your beautiful vacation or your healthy children or your lovely home and you write hashtag blessed, you are offensive because you were. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, God. You like it, this is great. This is great because this is just femininity in and of itself it, the, the lack of gratitude for what you have or uh, or what seems to be a bit of jealousy you know like oh they go on vacations everything and sweetie you don't particularly realize that you're doing what social media wants you to do when you do this right like social media wants you to be jealous of that vacation that they took or how healthy their children are and in reality whatever you see on social media this video included right it's only just a snapshot of time and that's it you don't know the rest you don't know the entire situation you don't know whatever is going on behind those scenes behind those photos which is why it's always best to take them with a grain of salt you know it toss it a like if you want to if you want to like it but outside of that just you know okay cool that's 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 cool that's, that's a cool thing but i just uh, took a few moments out of my day to enjoy uh, or to, to or to think about or to listen to. So, yeah, sweet. Like that's once again, all like one of, my, one of my the best things my dad ever told me was that no matter where you go in this world, you take you with you and how you perceive things is how things will more than likely play out. If you go walk into it thinking, hey, this is gonna suck, then guess what, it's gonna suck. And if you go, if you're online and you're looking at people's pictures with the mindset that, I'm jealous, I, I, I want that, I wanna do that, then guess what? It, it's like you're gonna project this type of energy out into the world. Not chosen as one of God's favorites, you were given opportunities that other people were not, including access to health care, a job, health insurance, and there are many people in this world who are oppressed who do not have access or opportunity to have the things that you have. So you are but, uh, see, Okay, so first and foremost, we didn't play the game off top. I usually play the game, but because she goes so, like, you know, because of how just malicious and condescending this chick is, uh, I kind of just, like, let it rock. But if you were to ask me straight up and down strokes 
strokes. Definitely strokes. I'm like pulling out without a question. But like, yo, I'm I'm definitely hit. Like, yo, and that's the thing. Crawl up in the guts. Like, if if, if you are in the top five. I don't know. She's probably on 45, but either way, but if I were to be able to get in there in the top five, right. And just, Hey, you know, think of it this way. <laughs> I'm telling you, she'd be on some, uh, you know, fuck them. Shit. My life is great. This is, you know what I'm saying? I'm getting off every name. My life is good. We going out, we doing things. You know, I'm, I, I'm, I'm living a good enough life myself. I'm not worrying about your shit. You know what I'm saying? That's as men, that's really that 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 really is another portion of the um of our contribution to the uh to 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 to, to complement our you know saying like like the to compliment the woman. You know, that's really a big part of our contribute our complimentary contribution. Bang. Let's keep going. <laughs> not some man in the skies favorite because you are better than others you are privileged and that's okay just use your privilege in a positive way but that's the thing i mean why who the fuck are you <laughs> use your privilege in a positive way use your privilege however you want because guess what like we established in the beginning of this video it's all a privilege right i mean every freaking twitch of your finger is a privilege that you should be grateful for whether or not and you atheists fucking kill me you really do because <laughs> oh you know that ridiculous man and the spaghetti monster in the sky like shut the fuck up okay <laughs> you guys like well, first and foremost there are no atheists and foxholes and b as far as proof is literally you just not hey if you don't want to believe it, fine. But when you sit there and spread your horse shit, you are in fact spreading horse shit, and you're sp and, and then you turn around and complain about a lot of problems. That I particularly noticed that with Devin Tracy, like you'll complain about a lot of shit that hey, your atheism doesn't help with. You know, like if you want to keep families together, if you want pe if you want people to grow up in, in in households, if you want women to be in the best position, to be in position and come up in a culture that actually encourages them to actually mate with a guy as few guys as possible. You know, yeah, take a couple of tests out there, but realize you kind of got a limit, sweetie, before you can really feel a connection with a person. And uh, <laughs> so choose wisely. But uh, it, it, instead of doing that, no, 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 no. It's like through through uh, religion and the like. It's like, oh no, no, God's stupid, and and all of religion is uh, and all of religion, like God's stupid as well as religion. It's like, no, 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 no. God's one thing, religion's another, and religion isn't the uh, it, it, and yeah, religion does have its flaws, but it also particularly you know Judeo Christian values and the like. I know a lot of people hate the, hate the, uh, hear that terminology, but they did help build this nation in one way, shape or another. It, it did help create a baseline for which, you know, the nation was able to get to the point where, hey, we are now as far as, you know, comfort and amenities, many of which a lot of folks who, t who talk a big game would not be willing to uh, sacrifice. And remember that you are not hashtag blessed. Yes. Yes, we are, sweetie. This, you are the reason why Timothy 2.12 is a verse in the Bible. Like, we're not supposed to listen to you. You do realize that, right? Like, yo, like, honestly, the, the bullshit that comes spewing out of your mouth, it really is just for your man to hear and to, and to completely shut the fuck down. Not, like, you're, there is supposed to be, you're, you, your your man, that man you don't need, sis, sis, sis is your filter, all right? Like, he's supposed to be your filter. He's supposed to be like, uh, sweetie, run that past me right quick before you go saying it out loud. Out loud. <laughs> you might want to run that past me a couple of times. Like, shit, sitcoms used to be built off of that of that premise. Not just the men, but the, or the man and the wife, you know what I'm saying? Just, hey, you know, run it past me first before you go, uh, on out there and shoot it off to the world. Because what you just shot off here was pure unadulterated bullshit. All right. So, guys, with that being said, we're going to bring this one to an end. All the Internet stuff. If you like it, toss it a like, dislike. Go ahead. Do that too. Nobody's scared of you. Sub. If you enjoy my fantastic voice and we get videos like this every single day, share. Because sharing is caring. And YouTube and bitch you and the like aren't 
the aren't, aren't the biggest fans of your boy over here for very obvious reasons. Bang the bell for notifications. Get something from Teespring. Check me out on Patreon as well. Links in the description. I just go in the description box and do damage. The reason I sped up to get to the end of that was because I just really noticed the hairline. Jesus. When I, when I stopped there, <laughs> when I slowed down. <laughs> In the middle of the end of my little, at the middle of the end where I'm like, wait a second, that hairline, woo! Still stroke it up, still stroke it up. But hey, you may disagree. That's what my comment section's for until the next one. See what makes you cheer. Every breath I take without your permission raises my self-esteem.